U.S. President Donald Trump has largely brushed off North Korea's latest launches, saying they don't violate the understanding he reached with North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. Now, while Trump seems relatively unconcerned, security experts say otherwise. Our Oh Soo-young has more. North Korea's latest missile tests are a clear sign of the regime's upgraded attack capabilities. This is according to the Washington Post, which on Thursday quoted various defense experts who raised concern about the regime's test firing of short-range missiles over the last four months. The launches included at least two new types of ballistic missiles, including the Rode Mobile KN-23. According to the Post, these missiles appear to threaten South Korea's missile defense system, with a missile fired last Tuesday flying at least 450 kilometers. Vipin Narang, a professor of political science at MIT, also pointed out that the missiles are short solid fuel projectiles, which means they can be deployed and fired at short notice. They also fly at lower altitudes, making them harder to intercept with South Korea's current anti-missile systems such as THAAD. Experts told the Daily that North Korea may not be able to miniaturize a nuclear warhead to mount onto a missile like the KN-23 just yet. But even conventional warheads could be devastating if they target South Korea's nuclear power plants. Pyongyang said its missile tests last Saturday included a new weapon that was different from previous weapon systems, but did not specify what it was. Observers say it's too soon to be certain about the latest weapon, but what's for sure is that the recent series of missile tests not only demonstrate the North's intentions to boost its military capabilities, but also help bolster Kim Jong-un's reputation at home as a powerful leader. Oh Soo-young, Arirang News.